back with part two of my springtime fragrance collection, okay? So, as I said in my previous video, was that? Oh, you haven't seen the first video? No worries, no worries, girl, I got you. Look down in the description box below and click it. I will leave the link there and you can go watch part one of my springtime fragrance collection, okay? I got you, girl, I always got you. So, when I think of spring, y'all, I think of heat. Yeah, I think of heat because I live in Texas. So we really don't have what you would call a traditional springtime. I feel like when spring comes and you do this, we ride into summer pretty much. Like there's really no spring. So when I am in the um, when I'm searching for a nice spring fragrance i always tend to go with something that has citrus in it um i feel like the citrus um meshes well with my body when i'm outside in the heat if that makes sense you know you start to sweat and you know you kind of like you know ooh, i don't want to get musty you know what i'm saying you wear deodorant but i oh i have a tendency to pick Fragrances that have a more citrus in it than floral or anything else. So we gonna get into um, a few of my fragrances. I have about five here that I think are perfect to wear for springtime. Okay, the first one is uh, Dolce Gabbana the One. Um, this is a really unique fragrance. If you've never smelled it, it's been out for a while now, and it's, it's very unique. It's very unique. Uh, let me tell y'all the notes. So the notes are mandarin, orange, lychee, and peach. So that's why I picked it to be in the spring collection. So do you guys switch out your fragrances uh, from fall to spring and summer? Let me know. I, because I, I do that. I like put all my fall fragrances and wintertime fragrances up and then I bring out my spring and summer y'all do that too let me know anyway back to the fragrance um it's very different and i i like it this is like my probably my third bottle of this and i feel like it's really good like for springtime and summer um let me spray it a little bit because i haven't sprayed it in a while yeah, it, I definitely smell the mandarin, orange, and the peach. And I feel like elements like that go really well with spring and summer. It's not overpowering. You know, it's not going to get on anybody's nerves. I feel like it's going to mesh well with your body once you start sweating and stuff like that. So I like, I really like this one for spring and summer. Um, the next one is a cousin of the Dolce Gabbana, the one. This one's been around for a very, very long time. Um, Y'all, it's nothing new. Uh, the reason why I picked this one is because again, it has that grapefruit vibe to it. And I think it's perfect for springtime. Um, it's very subtle. I feel like you can wear this to the gym. You can wear it to work. It will, you know, go really good with your skin and chemistry and eat sweat if you're going to be outside doing activities and things like that. I think this is really a good one. Sorry, I don't have the top to this. This was a tester. Um, but I really, really enjoy this fragrance and I have for years. So the notes in this one are um, cedar, lemon, apple, and rose. So that lemon is, is what I really like in it. It's very prominent when you smell it. It, it just smells to me like a very citrusy um, fragrance that I really enjoy. So this is a good one if y'all gonna be outside Y'all gonna be running errands, whatever, at school, work. I feel like this is a good one to wear and you won't offend anybody. Um, the next one is uh, Dylan Blue from Versace hey, because it has that citrusy vibe in it. Um, but not only that, it has the citrusy vibe but on a mature level. I feel like this is a very mature fragrance 
um it has what are the notes citrus grapefruit peach jasmine and white woods i think the white woods ups it a little bit and makes it more of a mature fragrance i feel like this is great to wear um in the summertime or spring springtime or summertime on a date night this is going to be a really good one because y'all know it just don't be hot in the daytime child it be hot at night too especially where i'm at so i feel like this is a really good one to go good with your body chemistry once you get outside and you might start sweating or whatever i feel like this is still gonna smell really good on the skin and it's just a very pretty fragrance very mature pretty um and a very good springtime fragrance so i have the cousin to um the versace this is woman now y'all know if y'all watch my previous videos y'all know i can talk about this fragrance forever child i just had to bring it out because it has that raspberry element to it and it's just super fun it's just like a really fun fragrance like it's just it's fun and it's sexy as hell you know what i'm saying it's just look even from the bottle the bottle looks like kind of weird but it looks like a fun bottle you know what i'm saying this one is just so pretty very glamorous gorgeous sexy beautiful woman you know what i'm saying it's gonna be perfect for a springtime summertime date night in the springtime or summertime it's just really it embodies its sexiness the notes in it are jasmine, raspberry, plum, lotus, and rose. The rose, I don't feel like it's in your face. Um, I feel like you smell the raspberry more than anything. So that's one of the reasons why I picked this to be in the springtime collection. Love this fragrance, y'all. Okay, so the last one I have to talk about in my springtime collection is the body by Burberry. So y'all know I've talked about Burberry fragrances um, in one of my videos. If you haven't seen it, I'll click it down below. I'll click my Versace video as well because I talked about that too um, a couple of months back or maybe a month or so back. Burberry fragrances are really hit and miss for me. Um, I just feel like it doesn't always hit the mark for me um, as far as you know me being attracted to them um and i don't really have a lot of burberry fragrances but this is one that came out a while back and i wanted to give it a try and see if, if something that i if it's something that i would like and it is a bouquet and when i say bouquet i mean floral like a big bouquet of flowers okay but because it has another element in it it's not overpowering you know what i'm saying the floral is just not you know in your face and y'all know i am trying to um love i shouldn't lie and say love child okay i'm trying to get into florals more and i know that uh, a lot of fragrances have a floral element in it but the most most of the times the ones i pick um the floral is there but it kind of goes away once it dries down so that's what this one is once the dry down kicks in you don't really get that floral too much okay so in this one it has green absinthe it has peach freesia rose iris and vanilla and i love how in the dry down when at a at first initial spray of this and I'm going to just give it a little spray. You know, I really never spray my fragrances in the air. I don't know what's going on with that, but I just rather spray it on my skin. But for the sake of the video. Um, okay, let me do it. <clears throat> okay. I get the rose. And it's not very loud it's there you smell it okay um i get the green i get the green absinthe and i get the freesia okay i have sprayed this on my skin once it dries down that vanilla kicks in and it makes it better for me 
So that's why I love it. I feel like this is a perfume that I could pick up, you know, when I'm running errands, if I'm gonna go out for coffee or hang out with my friends, I feel like this is one that I can pick up and wear any day, any time. Spring, definitely springtime and summertime. I feel like it's gonna really, really go do well with me being out in the heat. And that's why I will be picking it up a lot this summer and wearing it, wearing it. <laughs> um, I like it, I really like it. And that's saying a lot for me because I really don't get along with Burberry fragrances that much. But y'all, this is a really, really good one for springtime and summertime. Okay, love that. All right, so that concludes my series on springtime, summertime fragrances. I hope you guys enjoyed this video. I want to give a big shout out to those that um, like my videos, that are always leaving nice comp comments to me. Um, I love that so much. Thank you for your support. If you're new to my channel, then welcome. Go ahead and hit the like button. Go ahead and subscribe so you can get all the videos that I do on fragrances. And some other things are going to be coming up too. I know y'all been asking me about makeup and I'm really building myself up to that. I really do want to do a makeup tutorial for y'all. So be patient with me. I'm building myself up to do it. Who knows, you might get one in a couple of days. But I thank you so much for watching my video and I will see you guys later. Bye.